hello everyone welcome to today's video of the daily target series so let's start building today's target and today's is in fact a target only a gun target like i don't remember the perfect name but it is actually called but i'll just call it target itself so i'll begin with body and i'll give it first of all background background which is going to be this color let's paste it okay also i'll try to just keep all the similar properties together so display flex or maybe we can use grid grid ow place items center so for now i'll just check the sizes so first i'll go with this bigger div like the biggest circle so i'll just switch on the difference so that i can see it rather easily maybe 200 no 200 is more than enough so maybe 150 175 is the answer like mostly the values that are used are a multiple of 5 only like mostly used values are 25 then 50 75 and 100 so accordingly i just choose my values and they turn out to be correct so border radius and the border radius is 50% okay so it is a little bit bigger than it should be maybe 173 170 yeah 170 is the perfect value I was going for a rough one but we have got the perfect value so why not also, I just remove these properties across. Then what I'll do is dot a and I'll give it the properties here. So what I simply did is this is div a. Okay, so I just gave the similar properties inside the div. So now if I make this div, then the properties would be in inherited, which will make our task quite a lot easier. Let's paste it this time B. And I think, okay, let's do one thing, comma dot A. Wait, no, 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 no. I had to do it here, comma dot A. And I'll take that B div inside the A div. So cross, let's paste it. Okay, and the B div will obviously have a smaller size. I'll go with 150. And height also 150 and we need, need to give it a different color but that color is similar to the color of body so we are going to do this it's a little bit big I think maybe 140 130 yeah 130 is the answer so now we have got the 130 value let me once check by removing the difference yeah it's quite a lot same so now there would be a third div as you can see like i didn't even need to use these border radius and that because it is obviously in the correct state now if i go with c like first let me do one thing 
even B has the same properties. Now we are good to go. Now the C div will be inside the B div. Its size would be smaller and that's it. Not anything more than that. But the size would be too small. Maybe 50. And height also 50. Okay. It's correct at the first try. Now we need to create these four. I don't know what they are called. So I'll not even try to pronounce it. I'll create another div. So. Ow. I didn't even realize when I selected them. Let's paste it. Now I'll just do one thing that I'll like A, B, C. Now it's D. And the D div will have four divs inside it. Also D will have the... I'll tell you later on. After D, E. F. G. And H. Like, I, I know this code is a lot longer than someone would expect, but... We just want it to be simpler. So for the D div, all we have to do is position absolute. Okay. Now for the, for all other divs, like the E, F, G, H, they'll have obviously the same sizes. So this is how I'll do it. Now, as an approximation, I think the width would be around 50 pixels only and the height will be 10 pixels or maybe 20. Let's see. So let's remove the difference. Okay, so they'll also have position absolute. Position absolute. And I know we do not have to have a border radius of 50%. Okay. So what we would be doing is. I'll write just div. Right. And now I'll just remove. Wait, let, let me do this. Dot A, comma, dot B, comma, dot C. And there is something wrong, maybe. Like, maybe it isn't B here. What's even happening? Wait a minute. Yeah, now it's correct. Even if I put dot, like it isn't required. So this is it. Now we would be further on continuing on the, I don't even know what they are called. I just call it spikes. I know they are no near spikes, but we can call it comma B comma dot C. Okay, and for like, let's give them value here only instead of making it more crowded up above. So I would give border radius. I know 10 pixels. Like I can't even see it. dot e comma dot f comma dot g comma dot h so okay maybe it is 10 pixels i'm not sure 
I'll just start arranging it in a proper manner. So we need not do position. So I'll go with top zero, left zero. So where has it gone? Nowhere. Okay, I didn't even give the sizes for the D div. We can give the sizes of D div same as the A div. So I'll just go there. Comma dot D. Yep, that's good. Now I'll go to 50 or maybe further on like what's the half of 170 minus 10? Like half of I'll go with 80. 80 is the answer most probably. It's going to be a little bit above 75. And the left value would be like minus 10. No, 20. Okay, it's going to be a little bit longer. So width is maybe 60. Yeah, now it's correct. Now we will do the same for after E, F, G. It will be the same for G except here it would be right value. So 75 then comes left. We can also write left and give a bigger value. But I think this is better. You can see it's okay. I didn't even change the color. Never mind. I was thinking why there is a slight difference there. Paste. Yeah, not accurate. Now we need to give the properties for F and it will obviously have top zero. And it will have a rotate of 90 degrees. Also, H will have it, so I'm giving them together. Top zero. And left, like, it would be 75, I think. 75? No, 75 is way more than required. Maybe 65? 55? Is 55 correct? Yeah, 55 is correct. I'll just give the left value here only. So left 55. And H will have a bottom value of 0. Okay, and they'll have the same top. So dot E comma dot G they'll have a top value of 75 so I'm just making the common properties together okay so let's submit it I just wish it is correct although it is yeah 600.18 okay it took 810 characters for us to create this What's the global stats? Okay. 101 players have played. 750 characters is the average value. And R is 60 characters higher. Maybe we can decrease those things somewhere. Let me check once. If we have any chance to do that. Okay, so background color can't be. We can do it one way. I think we can dot E comma dot F comma dot G comma dot H. Ow. That wasn't supposed to be done. Okay, it doesn't even have a feature for undo what happened
why isn't h having a value that okay it's g i skipped the g one yeah so now it's 798 characters and we can just remove those lines we have given and spaces and it would be around 730 i think it would there is no way that it isn't around 750 then let me check once it won't take much time believe me as you can see we are already near 750 we would be way like really way way less than what we even expect maybe okay we have already gone less than 700 Okay. Like this would significantly increase our score. Although I know there would be multiple people who would have made this like in 200 or 300 characters because it is possible that way i am just out of practice to be honest and i also don't want it to be that complex because normal css is better to be used because we are doing this to practice css properly and not to just have a minimum character count let's submit it and our score will score will surely increase okay it's now 601 this much efforts for only one more okay so that's it for today's video hope to see the next one till then bye